Cyber teams from the U.S. Department of Defense will be deployed to the Mexican border to see if they can uncover how fentanyl and other drugs are getting into the United States. That move comes as part of the National Defense Authorization Act, which was recently passed by Congress. U.S. Senator Mike Rounds of South Dakota helped push for that funding. Reporter Tom Hansen has a closer look. Rounds recently talked with us about the passage of the National Defense Authorization Act, which basically provides funding for our national security from the Plains at Ellsworth Air Force Base to the National Guard Base in Sioux Falls and units around the state. As the top Republican in the Subcommittee on Cybersecurity, Rounds also pushed for action to secure the U.S. border with Mexico. We have now authorized our cyber teams within the Department of Defense to do research and to actually get down south of the border and find out as much as they possibly can about the transnational criminal organizations that bring fentanyl into our country, that are responsible for uh, uh, human trafficking and so forth. That impacts every state in the United States, including South Dakota. Round says the cyber teams will track down where the money's coming from that supports the illegal activity and gather specific information like who they bank with, who they communicate with, and where they live we'll be able to truly reach out and touch them and eliminate them uh, and and uh, get them to the point where they are no longer a threat um, to Americans any place uh, that, that currently they have an impact. 